The following is a paid commercial presentation of Information Communications Corporation. Since the dawn of time, the high and the mighty have turned to psychics for the secret of love and money. Now, the wisdom of the ages is as near as your phone, thanks to the Psychic Friends Network. Now, let's give a warm welcome to the five-time Grammy Award-winning host of the Psychic Friends Network, Miss Dion Warwick. Thank you so very, very much for that exceptionally warm reception. And to welcome all of you to our 12th edition of the Psychic Friends Network. We have a lot of really fun stuff for you today. But before we get started, I want to bring out my favorite psychic friend. She's internationally known as the authority behind the Psychic Friends Network. And recently, John F. Kennedy Jr.'s magazine, George, called her the Belle of the Crystal Ball. So, without further ado, let's welcome the belle of the crystal ball, Miss Linda Georgian. Great. And you look wonderful, too. <laughs> Girl, you've been busy. Oh, yes, I have been busy, and so have you. That's true. Is this really the 12th edition of the Psychic Friends Network? It sure is. How's that for an impressive audience? I say it's great. <laughs> I guess there's a reason why we've been around so long, Dion. Everybody knows that the Psychic Friends Network is the largest psychic service of its kind in the world. We may be the largest, but we still have that personal touch. All of our psychics work out of their own homes, so your call is always intimate and private. You can choose specialists that deal in romance, numerology, astrology, tarot cards, or almost anything you want. And you can call anytime from your home or office, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And all, all it, it takes, takes is, is a, a telephone, telephone and, and an, an open, open mind. mind. And now the Psychic Friends Network has been working on something that will make everyone smile. Callers will be treated to extra benefits like, are you ready for this, Dion? Mm. You get free five-minute ratings, free daily horoscopes, free daily lucky numbers, a palm reading kit, a full 22-card tarot deck, free birthday reports, and wonderful surprise gifts. That's terrific. I can't <laughs> believe it, my goodness. And the Psychic Friends Network has the best psychics from around the world. That's true. With the most experience in helping with our everyday questions, like you do sometimes with me. Oh, that's for sure. Yeah. That's what psychic friends are for. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, we did recently receive a wonderful letter from a single mom who benefited from the advice of her psychic friend. Watch this. Struggling to make ends meet and not being able to spend enough time with her only child, Morgan, Joyce Graham became overwhelmed with the pressures of being a single mother. Like so many other nights, she rushed home anxious to see her son before he went to bed. Hi, Kristen. I'm sorry I'm late again. Tell me he's still up. Sorry, Miss Graham. He tried to stay up, but he was so tired. Hey, okay, thank you, and thanks for your help. See you tomorrow night. Okay, bye. It all begins with a phone call to the Psychic Friends Network. A psychic friend is waiting to hear from you. Remember, all it takes is a telephone and an open mind. Having nowhere else to turn, Joyce decided to call Shakenna, her favorite psychic friend, for some good advice. What should I do? I see money coming to you, but not in the way you're expecting. The owner of the store will be moving to the East Coast and selling her store really soon. And Joyce, I see you owning the store. That all sounds so unbelievable. I'm barely getting by right now. I can't imagine what it would be like to own my own business. But I'll think about what you said. Thanks for the advice. It's an opportunity I just have to take. I have always wanted to live in New York and explore that business base. Well, what does that mean to us? I mean, when are you going to leave? Well, just as soon as I can find a qualified buyer. That could take as little as a week or a couple of months. I just don't know. I am sorry, but I trust you'll understand. Do 
Can you believe this? What are we going to do? I'm not sure. Hey, I have an idea. You watch the counter while I make a phone call. I got a friend I need to talk to. Just like you predicted. Joyce told Shekena her story and then listened intently as Shekena gave her valuable information on exactly how she saw her getting a small business loan. Okay, I'll give it a shot. Oh, I can't believe this is really happening. Well, the bank was proud to approve your loan, Joyce. Good luck with the new store. Thank you so much. It was my pleasure. Look, we did it. We did it. I told you it would work out. Thanks to the guidance from her psychic friend, Joyce is now the proud owner of a successful business. And here's to my new sales manager. Congratulations, Joyce. You deserve it. And she finally has the time she's always wanted for her son, Morgan. Oh, thank you, Mom. I'd like to introduce you to that single mom with all the right moves, Joyce. Joyce, why don't you tell all of us here, in your own words, the experience with the Psychic Friends Network? Well, when I was faced with unemployment and I called the Psychic Network, I got a very positive response from them, and I started making very positive moves in my life, and it was just, it led to wonderful things for me. Did you ever think that something like this would ever happen to you? Not in my wildest imagination. By the way, How's business? Business is wonderful. Yeah. It really is. Well, we're yes. thrilled for that. Thank you. And we thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you. Okay. And now here's something else you can believe. Now is your chance to get a professional, confidential reading from one of our master psychics and take advantage of the many benefits only offered by the Psychic Friends Network. So call the number on your screen right now. It was so accurate. Um, it was like talking to an old friend. She was really friendly and gave me great advice, and I could not believe how accurate she was in regards to what was presently happening in my life. You know, I didn't even have to ask any questions. She basically just started rattling off and telling me exactly what I wanted to know, and sure enough, everything that she had for foresaw did come true. I thought they would give you really broad answers or ask you really broad questions, but she got pretty specific, so that's what I was impressed with. I was like, how does she know this? She was telling me about my past, my basketball career, how in my sophomore year I was thinking about going to film school. I was, I was amazed. I was amazed. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe, I mean, I felt like she was following me, like she knew who I was from the beginning, from the day I was born, like she knew exactly who I was, what I was doing, when I was gonna call her, the time. Oh my God. Hi, I'm Dionne Warwick from the Psychic Friends Network. You know, over the years, there have been a lot of imitation psychic services, but there's only one Psychic Friends Network. In addition to having the best master psychics in the entire world, Callers to the Psychic Friends Network are now being treated to all sorts of great benefits, like free psychic readings, monthly newsletters, free daily horoscopes, lucky number selections, and so much more. It's all available to you. So call right now and start your relationship with a master psychic. You'll have a whole new outlook on life. So pick up the phone and start dialing. Remember, all it takes is a telephone and an open mind. You're watching the Psychic Friends Network. Welcome back, and thanks again for joining us. Remember, you can get a reading anytime you call the number on your screen. You know, Linda, as you know, we recently went to the Mall of America in Minnesota, where our master psychics gave free readings to all sorts of people. Yes, the psychics told me they had a great time meeting their fans. Well, they really did, and I got to do two of my favorite things, too. And what was that? Well, honey, I shopped till I dropped. Oh. Baby, that mall <laughs> is much too much. And I also got free psychic readings, but what I really enjoyed was when soap opera star Krista Tessero, who plays Tina Roberts on One Life to Live, got a reading. And here she is now, Krista Tessero. Well, I'm so happy you're here with us. Well, thank you for having me back. I have to tell you, I just couldn't believe that certain part of my reading last time where the psychic had told me my sister was going to have a baby. 
Somebody's having a child around you in the family. I don't know if th there's a new child entering. I don't know who it is, okay? So uh, if I told you I have two sisters and myself, could you narrow, narrow it down to either Kim, Kelly, or Krista? Let's narrow it down. It's not you. Okay. It's not me. <laughs> it's not you. Cancer. It's cancer. Yeah, it's, cancer. It's my sister Kelly. My sister Kelly has four kids already. I have to tell you, two weeks later, I was sitting at home, my phone rings, and my sister Kelly called me and told me she's having a baby. <laughs> oh, that's incredible. So, and she, uh, yeah. 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 Great. So I would say you were impressed with your psychic reading. I was very impressed. <laughs> well, you know, I understand you, you brought a friend with you. Yes. Well, he's a friend of yours, too. Yes. He had a, a great Psychic Friends reading in the past, and he's here for another reading. Uh, you all know him from General Hospital, Dr. Tony Jones. But to me, in real life, he's my pal, yes. Brad Mall. Yes. I, you know, it's very funny. I do a lot of talk shows, but for some reason, I was nervous today. I was excited. <laughs> yeah. Plus, my sisters at home, I'm sure, are quaking in their shoes for fear they may be pregnant. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> well, we just happen to have a master psychic, Elam, waiting on the phone here to give you a psychic reading. Have a seat here. Hello, Elam. Hello, Linda. Here, Brad, I want you to have some psychic fun. Hi, Elam. Hello, Brad. How are you doing? I'm great. Terrific. Uh, I'd like to start out with maybe a question that you have, uh, something that's uh, pertinent to you, that's important to you, that helps to focus your energy, and then that way I can find you, I can uh, connect with you. Okay. Uh, my career right now, it seems like one morning I woke up and it exploded on me. Uh, it feels as though you're going to start doing some things uh, in the way of directing. Uh, also, I get you going to Europe. Uh, and doing some films there. That's so funny because two things happened. One is a director on my show just about a month ago said that he would sponsor me if I wanted to start directing on the show because I'm always trying to direct on the show. And, and the other thing is I was telling the makeup girl today that I'm, for the first time in my life, I'm thinking of going to England uh, in the, the October, September, October. Uh, and I've never done that and I'm just gonna go on my own. So you're Terrific. on the money right now. Terrific, do it. Something else that I pick up about you also is that I feel like you're going to go into kind of exploring a little bit uh, of art in a way, maybe possibly painting or sculpting or something of that nature, purely for your own personal uh, expression and that sort of thing. What's funny is that uh, they used one of my paintings for the cover of a new cookbook Fantastic. that is a charity cookbook for uh, 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 awareness for uh, breast cancer victims, and it just came out this week. Ah, there, there so you go. So I haven't yeah. been paid, and I don't want to be paid, but the art is definitely a part of my life. I never thought I would have anything like right. that. Uh, there's also a woman around you that can influence this situation, too. My wife? Uh, I suspect it's your wife. Yeah. Strongly. Ah. <laughs> I've known her since I was 16. Whoa. Boy, I've never like made it. a psychic laugh. This is neat. <laughs> Uh, it's a pleasure to talk to you. It's just, oh, it's, it's great wonderful. to talk to you, and you're right, you're right on the money with the things that I'm secretly most concerned about. I, I don't really have any questions. I just know that this comes to my mind is that how much I love my kids. Oh. How old are they? Eight, ten. Okay. And seventeen. And seventeen. This is really stupid, but the reason I did this is that my brother died when, when I was 13. Brad, there's never a stupid question. The only stupid so question... So I worry about my children. They're going to be all right. Their health is fine. It's a good thing you can do this at home. <laughs> Yeah, it is. It, it's, it makes it more personal. Yeah. It definitely does. Wow. Didn't think this was going to happen. But your, your children are all right. They're all, they're all going to have... No, I know. They're little brats. They're wonderful. <laughs> they're very healthy, but... Very but normal. Now, now I'm sort of over it. I can get to the point, which is I've always been afraid because my brother died that I would lose a child. No, not going to happen. It's not going to happen. They, uh, they're going to outlive you. <laughs> don't worry about it. 
While Brad gets his reading, now is your chance to call the Psychic Friends Network and ask some of those questions you've been really dying to find out about. And don't forget all those benefits you get to enjoy if you call right now. I was most skeptical ever to call. I never thought I would call. And then after I talked with my psychic friend, I was hooked and I was very intrigued and I would definitely call again. I didn't believe in them. I didn't believe that they could tell you, you know, exact information over the telephone and that they could know what was going on in your life, but they proved me wrong. I only told her my name and what year I was born and my birthday. That was it. That's all I told her. And she just went on. She said, that's all I need to know. She, and she went on. And she just kept going and kept going and kept going. I was kind of skeptical, but I was willing to listen, and she told me things that really helped me. Sure enough, everything came true that she had forecasted, so I would definitely recommend it to my friends. If you're skeptical about a psychic, call them. All I gotta say is just call. I was skeptical, I called, and I was amazed. Hi, I'm Linda Georgian from the Psychic Friends Network. We've set up the Psychic Friends Network especially for you so that you can talk to one of our master psychics 24 hours a day, seven days a week. That way you can get the answers you need when you need them. In addition, the Psychic Friends Network is now treating its callers to all sorts of great benefits like free psychic readings, free daily horoscopes, and so much more. It all begins with a phone call to the Psychic Friends Network. So whether you're calling to find out about your love life, career, or just want to have a little psychic fun, a psychic friend is waiting to hear from you. Remember, all it takes is a telephone and an open mind. For some reason, I needed to get that pain out Absolutely. about my brother and stuff. Absolutely. But I've never actually had more fun oh, my in a pleasure. reading. My so pleasure. I, I truly appreciate it. I hope I talk to you again someday. Well, I'm on extension 5905 if you have any. Thanks, Paul. What did you think? Uh, look at the look on his face. Yeah, it's embarrassment, actually. Uh, oh. That was great. It was wonderful. He was absolutely right on on everything oh, he, he told me. And mm -hmm. the, best, the best thing is it gave me a, a real sense of peace inside about some stuff I guess I needed to talk about. Well, Linda and I both want to thank you for being on the show, Brad, especially for coming back and having a good reading, and we'll watch for you in General Hospital, that's for sure. <laughs> and Krista, of course, good to see you again. Thank and you. And thank you for coming. And we will watch for you on one, lot, two, three. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> All right. <laughs> now here's something that happens to everyone who calls the Psychic Friends Network, but me. For some reason, I don't know what this is. It's a love story with a very happy ending. Watch this. Although Judy and Bill lived hours apart, they had developed a close relationship by emailing each other over the internet. I miss you, love, Bill. And spending time together whenever possible. What Judy did not realize, however, was that Bill's feelings for an old girlfriend had resurfaced. I can't talk to you anymore. This is just too painful. Don't call me anymore. Call the Psychic Friends Network and get a psychic power reading of your very own. When it comes to the kind of psychic guidance that could actually change your life, you only want the best. You deserve only the best. Judy didn't know what to do, so she called her psychic friend, Crystal. Hi, this is Crystal at the Psychic Friends Network. How can I help you tonight? Hi, it's Judy. I haven't called in a long time, but I really need some good advice. My boyfriend, Bill, has gotten back together with his old girlfriend. Do not sever your communication with him. Believe it or not, right now, he needs your friendship more than ever. But I told him to never call me again. I'm sorry, but my feelings are too strong to just be friends. Judy, trust me. Bill and this woman will be breaking up. He will be contacting you in January. January 15 comes to mind. You must keep in touch with him. He is your soulmate, and he will come back to you. Judy decided to take her psychic friend's advice and give Bill one more chance. Hello? Bill? Hi, it's me, Judy. Please don't say anything, just listen. I want you to know that no matter what happens, I will always be here for you. If you need me, I'm just a phone call or an email away.
Mm. Speaking of New Year's resolutions, isn't it about time you enter the dating scene again? Yeah. Hey, what about that great guy you met at the party last night? Yeah, girl, he was obviously interesting. Come on, you guys. I only have to wait a couple more weeks. I told you what my psychic said. You don't really believe all that, Judy. Oh, well, look, I'm sorry. It's just that we don't want you to be disappointed. So call me a hopeless romantic. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, Judy, your time's up. I'm taking you out tonight, and I don't want to hear another word about it. Oh, come on. Everybody's going. It'll be fun. You just don't give up. Okay. Oh, I've got an email. Oh, my gosh. It's from Bill. Just as Judy's psychic friend Crystal had predicted, <laughs> Bill realized he had made a mistake. Thanks to the Psychic Friends Network, Bill and Judy are now working towards a lasting and loving relationship. I'm so glad you didn't give up on me. What made you hang in there? I got some good advice from a friend. I met a guy I really liked and wanted to see him again. The moment my psychic heard my voice, he said the guy was about to send me a box of roses. Two hours later, I opened the door, and there they were, just like my psychic said. I was desperately looking for a job, so I called the Psychic Friends Network. My psychic said I would get a lead from a friend and to follow up immediately. I did, and I got a job on the spot. Hi, I'm Dionne Waller from the Psychic Friends Network. You know, over the years, there have been a lot of imitation psychic services, but there's only one Psychic Friends Network. In addition to having the best master psychics in the entire world, callers to the Psychic Friends Network are now being treated to all sorts of great benefits, like free psychic readings, monthly newsletters, free daily horoscopes, lucky number selections, and so much more. It's all available to you. So call right now and start your relationship with a master psychic. You'll have a whole new outlook on life. So pick up the phone and start dialing. Remember, all it takes is a telephone and an open mind. And when I hung up the phone from my psychic friend, I felt invigorated. I had this energy that was, that I've never felt before. I hung up and I was so excited. I was so intrigued I had to call my friends and tell them. It felt really good. She just brightened up my whole day. I felt like a great weight had been lifted off my shoulders. She knew who I was, she knew me, she knew my family. She told me about my family. She told me how things were gonna be better and it happened almost identical spot two weeks. I'd call again, definitely. This is the Psychic Friends Network. Welcome back. Linda, you remember on our last show, we had a lot of fun with a gentleman from the audience named Doug. Yes. Well, let's take a look at this clip. So I see somebody with their hand open giving you money. Right. And this is payment for some type of service. Uh -huh. You've been waiting for this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All my life, darling. <laughs> well, it's going to happen this year. All right. And I see you accepting it with your arm around some woman. <laughs> like this? good pose it really oh. is well we really wanted to see how things turned out for you Doug. linda you were right on the nose oh thank you in the last year my uh, income has almost doubled Wonderful. through a series of raises mm -hmm. and i even got a brand new best friend this is sean <laughs> right. You're very special lady. <laughs> by the way i see your success continuing money's going to continue things will continue to evolve um and i get a very good uh, around your girlfriend here, and I see that's uh, looking better as time goes on here as well. Cool. So, uh, and I do pick up <laughs> an unusual romantic adventure coming for you wow. very soon, and the outdoors. Ooh. So, um, that's something to look forward to. <laughs> yeah, actually. <laughs> you, you can share it with us on the next show. Uh -huh. I sure will. <laughs> and good luck. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Thank you. You know, it could be you we talk to next, so pick up the phone and take advantage of the additional benefits from the Psychic Friends Network. Remember, we're often imitated, but never duplicated. Those other psychic services don't even come close. 
Make sure it's a Psychic Friends Network you're calling to be sure you get a master psychic reading and more. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Good stuff, girl. Oh, yes. Well, it's been another great show. Oh, I had a great time. It really flew by. It really did. We almost forgot, you know, the, the most oh, fun we had yes. at the end of the show. Yes, that's right. You know, psychic this is my greetings. Part. Yes. <laughs> Does anybody have a question they'd Who like wants to answer? a psychic greeting? <laughs> I think I'd like to start over here uh, with this gentleman right here. Would you please stand up there on the front? Mm -hmm. I see around you a little bit of gray. Uh, gray indicates some delays or unhappiness with some situations that are going on around you right now with your career situation. Is, is this uh, sort of a, at a standstill right now for you? Yeah, that's very okay. true. Okay. I feel you're a spiritual person. I don't know if uh, you're working at communicating more, but I feel it would be helpful to do that. Uh, did you have a particular question you'd like to ask me? You know, actually, you pretty much answered it. Because uh, I, I was going to say something about my last two years <laughs> were rather tumultuous, and you've kind of hit it on the head without Good. even saying anything. Well, <laughs> just keep uh, positive, uh, be around positive people, and move in the direction you're going in. Things should unfold Great. nicely. Okay. Okay? Good All luck. Right. <laughs> All right. Raise your hands if you're interested in another reading. Up, up, up. Okay, let's see. I'll come to this lady down here with the red scarf. Would you stand up, please? Okay, um, the first thing that I'm picking up around you is um, I'm picking up a little bit of a green. Green is always an indication of financial gain, things improving, some travel. This is a good time for you with career because it's right around your aura at this time. So this should be a time when you're making decisions, making changes. Are you in the midst of doing this right now? It's amazing. That's just what I was going to ask you. <laughs> I can't believe it. Well, I mean, I am a psychic. I know. I know. <laughs> I better do this good. <laughs> Wonderful. Okay. Thank you for the right, take care. Okay, raise your hands again, and I will select somebody else here. Uh, this lady, uh, the young lady right there, Dion, right? Stand there with the pretty dress on. Sure. Mm hmm. Okay, uh, you have a lot of white in your aura. White is always psychic, spiritual. Uh, you have a lot of love in your heart. I see that you're very kind, caring. And there is also a little bit of frustration around with the career situation because I see it in red. Red is always a block right now. And I also see that you're a very creative person. I do see you writing. I also feel that it will lead to a new job for you as this happens because I see the old going and the new coming yes, in. Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. I feel romantically, it's sort of open right now. Mm -hmm. um, I do see that there is like uh, one man, another man, there's like more, <laughs> th there's two men. Yeah. <laughs> Don't sit down. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm shopping around, you know. You're shopping around. Well, <laughs> now, did you want to ask me a question? Um, no, you explained my life, really. Everything, you told everything. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, good luck. Here okay, thank you. <laughs> this has been a paid commercial presentation of Information Communications Corporation. Call them. I'm, I'm telling you, you will be amazed. You will be amazed. It was great. It was a super experience.